This tutorial will provide an overview of Interlibrary Loan and how to set up your Interlibrary Loan account. Interlibrary Loan is a free service offered by the library through which you may submit requests for books or articles to be sent to you. We're going to start at the library homepage here, library.shu.edu. Interlibrary Loan or ILL requests for articles are usually delivered as PDF files to your ILL account often on the very same day you submit the request or the next day. Print books you request through ILL can be picked up from the library circulation desk or if you are an online or distance education student the books can be mailed to you wherever you are. To use Interlibrary Loan you need to set up your Interlibrary Loan account. So from the library's homepage here click on the services link the top. Then in the drop-down menu select Interlibrary Borrowing. Next you're going to click on this link, Interlibrary Lending Account, here. You'll be brought to this logon page. Enter your PirateNet credentials, your username, and your password. The first time you log on, you'll be brought to this new user registration for ILLiad page. Fill out the fields with red asterisks. Use your home mailing address where you live in the address line fields. Leave the last box, authorized users, blank. When you've completed the form, click on the submit information button at the bottom of the page. Now your account is set up and ready to use. Let's return to the Interlibrary Borrowing page one last time. From the Library homepage, go to Services, Interlibrary Borrowing. If you scroll down, you will see two big blue buttons. One to request books, one to request articles. These features will be explained in a separate tutorial on how to request books and articles. But if you want to try it yourself, go right ahead. A little bit lower you'll also see contact information for two people. If you have any questions about Interlibrary Loan, send an email to either Sebastian Derry or Xiaoxin Li. This is the end of the tutorial. Thank you for watching.